Order really means to live life golden Yeah, we're golden, baby girl, we're golden They're about to see it shine, cause we're golden Hey guys, welcome back to another video and in this video, I'm going to show you guys a magic trick. So this video, I want to show you guys how you can use the old YouTube app in 2018. So this YouTube app right there, the iconic classic YouTube app right there. Not the, you know, the application like this one, you know, the real YouTube app. Okay, so I'm going to show you guys how to do it in 2018, right? No, nada, you know, I'm not doing any abracadabra. This is basically just pure amazing, right? So to prove it to you guys here, I do have an iPhone 3GS. Um, it is running 5.1.1. And uh, just for the sake of it, today is July 2018, right? So 2018, you know, no rolling back the date or IP address changing, no nada. Look at this. Open up the app. Let me see a feature here. Look at that. The video loads. The video loads. Let's go to search here. And there you go search works look at that and the, mo the most view tab works but uh, the only thing that doesn't work is the sign-in tab look at that despacito is most viewed huh? what is despacito 2 please so yeah the only thing that doesn't work is uh, the sign-in feature so you can't use your subscription your playlist or this more feature basically doesn't really work let me show you guys how to do this all right how to do this how to do this trick man so i have this ipad touch 4 generation this is the white one and it's running 5.1.1 Alright, not, not 5.1.1, sorry, 4.3.3, my bad, my bad 4.3.3 and if you guys wondering what happened, of course, you already know what's happening If you guys don't install this magic, this is what, we, what will happen So, it we're just loading, YouTube not available and you cannot do anything Back in the days, I think like last year, there was supposed to be like a video saying like This thing is not, this thing is not working, but looks like that will not work So yeah, this will come up now back in the days before, uh, I do, I do, I do found a bug. I think like two years ago, where you can use the sign in feature. Right, they will sign in, and you can watch the video on your favorites tab. Like you literally can use the YouTube app. I think two years ago, two years ago, I found this bug, and I don't have time to share it, so nobody knows it. But yeah, that's how two years ago. No, it no longer works. So first step, you have to be jailbroken. Alright, you see what happened before the YouTube app says YouTube not available. So we're gonna go to Cydia again, you have to be jailbroken. Let it load. Okay, once Cydia is loaded, you're gonna go to sources. We're gonna go to add a source and we gotta add the source that I put right there, which is uh, cydia.infosplaygames.co.uk. So let me type that repo real quick. Okay, now click add source. Okay, now we're gonna go ahead and search for the tweet called Tube Fixer. Tube Fixer, look at that, free tweak. Now, as you can see here, it says a simple little fixer for the good old YouTube app from iOS 1 to 5. But uh, as I do see here, I have an iPhone 3GS. You can see this is a different 3GS, this is the iOS 5.1. This one turn on, and this is the iOS 3 one. For some reason, Cydia in iOS 3 just keeps saying loading data, even through. Yeah, it doesn't, I don't know. I don't think the Cydia fault, so we gotta, we gotta try it on iOS 3, but it does work still on iOS 4 here. So we gotta go ahead and install it, tweak. Hit confirm, and we gotta watch the magic happen. While we're waiting for the to tweak to install, let's take a look at our sponsor. Okay, so if you guys lost a data on your phone, man, that is just the the hardest feeling that happened, man. It happened to me once, all right? I accidentally formatted an SD card and it just gone forever. Like that's just very sad. But yeah, I'm gonna show you guys a program that you guys can recover your data from like a broken device, even if the screen is cracked and nothing works. I'm gonna show you guys how you can recover the data from the device. So let's so let's see here. I do have an iPhone 5 here. You can see the iPhone 5, it is stuck on a recovery mode. So I'm gonna open this program. It's called the iMyPhone d -Bag. This is literally the best one. So you can see here, the iPhone 5 is stuck on a recovery mode. So let's click start. So how did I lose my data? So I'm gonna click add. So you can see here, I can 
break our laws or deleted my data by accident, there's always that time, man. You accidentally delete something on your phone. Or maybe because factory reset, jailbreak, or iOS updates, it, it's oftenly happened because of those three, man. Or the iPhone is lost, you know, it's somewhere around the woods, it's damaged or broken. Or also you can, if you forgot your password, man, this is a very, very often they happen, man. You forgot your iPhone passcode and it is no longer work. Or use if your iPhone stuck at the app logo, recovery mode loops or black screen. So I have my iPhone 5 here in recovery mode. So let's see here. Various iOS issues. You can see, man, this program does a lot of things, man. Break iOS device. Usually you have to restore your iPhone to iTunes, man. With this program, man, you don't have to, man. This program will fix your brick phone. So let's see here. This thing is on recovery mode. Let's click exit and hit exit. And let's see. This will exit or it will, will exit or not. Ooh, we got the Apple logo. Okay, so as you can see, the program says exit recovery mode. Please check the device if it's starting or not. And looks like it is starting. Let's see if the iPhone started. Oh, it's it's vibrating. So it's definitely work. This program is definitely doing my job, man. It just saved this iPhone 5 life. Look at that. It just saved this iPhone 5 life in that recovery mode, man. Look, look at that. I can use my phone like normal again. Okay, aside from smart recovery, you can also recover data from an iOS device. So I do have my iPhone plugged in here. As you can see here, you can recover a lot of data. As you can see, yeah? messages, call history, even third-party chat like WhatsApp, Kick, and Line. Look at this. A lot of people in Indonesia also use Line, and then a lot of my friends also complain, you know, that they, their chat history is gone, so they can use this app, man. Basically, this is just amazing app to recover, right? So also, you can recover from an iTunes backup and iCloud as well. So as you guys can see, this is probably one of the best uh, data recovery software that I tried on iOS. So yeah, I will put the link in the description so you guys can try it out. I mean, from a long time, I tried this type of apps, but they just don't rarely work and this one works pretty well. Now let's get back to the video. Okay, now once it's week installed, you don't have to respring or reboot. Just press return to Cydia and the tweak will automatically work. So let me go home here, close that up. And let's open the YouTube app. The classic good old YouTube app. We go to feature to make sure it's not loaded. And there we go. The video works. And loaded just like normal. So let's just watch a video real quick here. Okay, so I just search for a video, just use my one of my friends' channel videos so I don't get any copyright reasons. So I just watch a video. And you can see here that it does work. And you can double tap the video, you can use this, uh, what is this? I already forgot all of these, but let's watch later. And what is this? Oh, you can send the email. Oh, I never actually used the old YouTube app, so I kind of forgot all those buttons to do. But yeah, so once you click down here, you can see the description of the video. You can rate, comment, or flag. Remember those days. And comments, I don't know comments work. So let's just try it here for, make for another double check. We're going to try it on iOS 5 here. Okay, so I have a video here. Let's just let's see if those work. So again, if you if you search a video, you know, click the arrow. It will say so where I bring this thing again. So you can watch the related video, but do it video again. You can put the favorites and all that. You can also play share the video. And let's see again. Oh, comments doesn't actually load. Okay, so again, when you click more info, you can you know subscribe to the specific channel and it will load the video. But yeah, maybe some of you guys who actually use the old YouTube app knows this stuff. I do use it back in iOS 3 when, when it's still signed and all that, but I already forgot those memories, man. Oh my god. Yeah, it's actually pretty nice. I mean, look at this. You can actually use the old YouTube app in 2018 without worries, man. You guys can just use it just, just like you use it. I mean, look, oh, you can, yeah, favorite tab board. So I think one of those buttons is favorites. And yeah, this is the video back in a year ago when it actually said it does not work but hey we hacked it man we uh we hacked a bit we hacked the thing man okay so it doesn't load anymore but yeah you can see here it actually loads the the related videos now which is kind of irony <laughs> but yeah 
So yeah, there is how to make the old YouTube app, the classic YouTube app works in 2018. So again, your your normal YouTube app, because when I use it, it will still works, but I still want to open it. So yeah, thank you guys for watching this video, and I will catch you guys in the next video.